Hey, what's up, guys? This is Ranusr Two Two Sixty Four back again for another video for you guys. All right, and this is the ultimate behind the scenes. Now you may be asking, "Hey, Ryan, didn't you already do one of these?" Yeah, but it disappeared, so gotta make another one. And this is my one hundred fiftieth video. Crazy, right? Man, I love making these things. So let's get on with this. This is Ranusr Two Two Sixty Four Ultimate Behind the Scenes. Alright, so the videos uh, start with um, writing them down in my notebook. This is my movie make notebook. That's a flash drive I have with uh, most of my modern plans. This is a, a copy of the Mind Bearers Memory script that I was looking over while filming. And this is the first script for the first video that I made. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Um, yeah, it's all mostly in Spanish, but luckily I remember what happened. So one of these days I'll have to go back through here and uh, translate it for myself. Uh, this is uh, Resonus Blades that I was working on. Some old art and stuff like that. I have tons of this old art. Uh, what else do I have in this movie making? Oh man, that's old. Man. Whatever. Some old drawings. Stuff like that. Um, hang on one sec. This is also one of my movie making notebook. I accidentally left it. Uh, I was I'm working on a um, uh, English essay, and most of the script that's on the English essay is in here, or at least partly. So yeah, I got this is my movie making notebook. Uh, this was one of the first videos, or one of the first videos that I decided to actually write down the little one. That was that video with that sunset figurine. It almost tore out of here, but luckily I was uh, see it almost tore out. I was able to staple it back in. Uh, Need some work there. Uh, this is my video ideas that I showed in my um, what's for 2018 videos. This is um, top videos. I kind of numbered it really badly. And uh, this is all my ideas. And I plan on making, and I swear I'm going to do. Hang on. Come on. There we go. Focus. I plan on making a video for most of these. Um, not every single will be a video. Obviously, this is not going to be a video. Um, that's probably not going to be a video. That's already done. This is kind of already continued. Um, that's still in the process. This is a, The script for this has been deleted, but I'm still working on that video. And it should eventually make it. The problem is one of my figures' feet is broken, so I'll have to buy a new one when I figure something out. But, anyways, <laughs> I was going... Where? Okay. So, for the entirety of Christmas, uh, December, I'm thinking about making a video every day. And I'll be doing reviews on probably these... And uh, definitely the mangas of this and this. Make one video a day for each one of the mangas, and that should be enough. This whole video, mostly can or mostly it's been cancelled, but it's still an idea that I'd like to pull off. Um, some other ideas. Plenty of song ideas. This game for evil, I'm still working on it. Um, it's actually, it's finished, but I need to film the rest of it. This is half the script. Um... The rest of it that I was continuing was on a flash drive that's broke sadly and I'm um, having to retype it all. This is um, some uh, ideas. My girlfriend's murder machine. I'm pretty sure I showed this off anyways. So this is um, that, working on that script. And this script is mostly finished. I was actually luckily able to retrieve that one. Yeah, that's, um, it's my movie making notebook. So that's really, actually, you know, that's mostly um, all the notes and stuff in here. Um, there's a handful of more um, storyboards. Let's see if I move this out of the way. Right here. For the Indiana Jones video that I made. Some ideas for Arc 2. Arc 2. This is a really old drawing that I had for Arc 2. See, I had a few ideas for him. Um, not really the main canon, though. But, uh, yeah, this is Arc 2 right here. Yeah, his I uh, my Actually, hang on. My original idea for Arc 2. Let's see if I can... To it. Oops, sorry. Ah, here we go. My original idea for Arc 2 was um, have more a rectangular head with a giant gun in the arm and have treads and a wheel. Um, yeah, that didn't exactly pan out all the way, but I did get the gun and I got an RT2 and I got a different body, got cool looking legs, and I think it worked out in the end. Um, I would still love to have a um, see a square R2. This is for a comic that I made in 8th uh, grade called Galaxy Wars. Yeah, it's some pretty decent designs. 
for ARC 2 VG6. I added the gun later. But yeah, this is, um, yeah, it's a better, oh, there, that's a way better drawing right there. So, that was the idea. So, that's, um, where most of my ideas are, kind of, are, uh, that's where most of my ideas kind of come from and where I write them down and stuff. Hopefully I don't lose this. I would, I would suck, and with the fires and everything, I'm very, very grateful that I still have this. Alright, so now I'm going to go into the props and stuff that I use. Alright, let's go. Alright, so these are the helmets that I use. Um, this is the helmet I've used for mostly every single video that I've, well, had a chance to really put this in. I put it in. This is a really nice helmet. I know the lighting's not very well. Not very good. Let's see if I can... Yeah, I'm trying to make it better. So, yeah, the helmet's really nice. Um, yeah, that did get damaged in a, um, battle against one of my friends. That was a huge mistake on my part. So, for Halloween, I picked up this one. This one is definitely smaller. Um, I can still wear it though. And this one's got a cool feature over here. It's got lights. Yeah, yeah it's it's pretty cool. So I'm thinking about using this helmet a little more in the here. Actually start using this helmet in the videos. Just because it's smaller. Um, I can still wear it. Um, it is tight. And uh, this one's damaged. And I want to get this fixed. My sister has volunteered herself to work on it. Uh, I got a little medic symbol right there. So, these are the helmets. But the first helmet I ever used in any of my videos was this one. This is the same helmet. It's um, definitely more worn and torn than it once was and I cut out the visor and had to put it in a pseudo visor. You can actually see all those slots pretty well. And um, somehow it's survived. So that's one of the helmets that I use, mask helmet things that I use. The other one that I am using is, uh, this is my Blood Trooper helmet mask thing. It was a Stormtrooper helmet painted with red spray paint, making it looking blood, and I got some duct tape right there. Um, for my actors, I did write notes inside the helmet. Can't see a thing out of this helmet. Um, that's the, um, line of sight you can't really look down. I got my, um, kind of code right there. So those are the masks. Uh, one of the other things I used in a handful of my videos, uh, one of the other things I had or used in my video, this is most that was most for the Indiana Jones video and the um, uh, uh, Hatsune Miku's 11th birthday slash anniversary. This is my uh, Indiana Jones fedora. I um, actually did get this at Disneyland. I kind of read it and it's the Indiana Jones logo. I don't know why it's got that weird strap thing you do it. That's kind of weird. I love this fedora. I've started using it a lot more personally in my life with Boy Scouts and stuff. Um, definitely a lot better than my other fedora that I was using. I definitely enjoy it. And this is the sunglasses that I usually wear. Yeah, they're kind of damaged, but yeah, it's pretty cool. Alright, so that was all the hats and stuff. And this is the last bit of clothing I want to really show before I get into my armor pieces. This is just uh, an army jacket that my grandpa um, bought, and then he um, got someone to sew on the patches that are kind of cool. Yeah, I got that. And I got a don't show on me. Pretty cool pretty cool. Alright, now for the props and stuff that I use. This is a part that I kind of want to talk about. Um, this is just a Lego X-Wing. I've had this thing. I got this for Christmas. It's a very nice X-Wing. I've used it in tons of my videos. I really love it. It's a great X-Wing. This is the Falcon that I use. Um, I have multiple different Falcons, and I'll be showing the others in a minute. Uh, this is the Falcon I've used in pretty much all the videos that I've used in the Millennium Falcon. Pretty much. Um, for the Droid Escape, this is all of my astromech droids, and this is my custom character. Orion SR2264. He's got a quote unquote end zap, and he's got that Master Chief helmet from a third party. Yeah, this is all of my droids. This is my favorite R2 right here. This is an Arc 2 VG6. I had an idea for him. He has a square head. Uh, same body as R2 2 and has a gun on the side. Um, the reason I didn't use this headpiece for um, the My Brave's Mirror video is because just the circular RT2 just looks better in the next one. So yeah, this is my droids. This is the stand I usually use for my tablet when filming. So I legit kind of put uh, put it in backwards. My tablet flipped. But uh, that's basically this is the stand I usually use. Yeah, pretty crazy, right? And thing handful of Legos and stuff. All right, now for the mo other problem. All right, I gotta be honest. Pardon the terrible lighting. But um, but um, this is my figure collection, and it's just sitting. It's honestly just sit sitting on a shelf. I know you guys can't really see it, 
But that's just all. That's where all my uh, figurines just kind of sit until I start using them. Um, handful of different ships. Those are the Falcons right there. There's the Y wing, X wing. There's a DeLorean right there. Some sniper rifles right there. I can tell that little yellow thing and that red stripe. Uh, that's Yoko's sniper rifle. Actually, the lighting is not that bad. But, um, Optimus, there's a Veritech, there's a um, Xenomorph right there, another Veritech, Ryan from My Girlfriend's Marine Machine, Boba Fett, Hasune Miku, R2-264, Steve, Konota from Lucky Star, BB-8, Yoko, Hasune Miku, Darth Vader's right there, some Angry Birds, R2-2 back there, Orion, Sunset, Arc 2 vd 6 a Ken R2-2 bomb, Sonic, Arc 2, Arc 2 vd 6s is um, backup, Black Arc Shooter, Ram, Miku, Cyber Miku, a Gundam, Chief, another Chief, Predator, BT, and X-Wing. Soon, I don't know Simon, whatever her name is, Diva's Mech, uh, Spartan, L Adventures, Luke Skywalker, Adventures, Dark 5, Mario, DeLorean, Diva, and uh, Sideshow Collectibles, RT2. Ah, that's a lot of stuff. And there's stuff down there. And last but not least, this is my bag of, um, uh, Parts and um, other things. Yeah, the whole baggie of them. Oh, let me just move this out of the way. Yeah, I keep everything bagged. This is Rems, uh, all the Veritech fighters, slash Transformer, Cyber Miku, RC2s, Black Rock Shooter, some uh, more Psy fighters, uh, U Wing right there, some other fighters, Miku. Uh, that's Yoko's. This is um uh, Quanta slash um Sunsetto. Uh, my last Sunsetto's bag. I don't know where it went, but uh, and Simon, or Simon, or whatever the hell her name is. It's like it has an M. So, so this is Ryan SRT two sixty four saying out me amigos. I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. I really went in depth with it. I don't even care if this gets viewed or not. This is Ryan SRT two sixty four signing out me amigos. And that was everything. Oh, wait, that's. I'm missing one thing. This is all my guns. That's uh, some. That's the um, armor right there. There's a sentry gun right there. And full of guns and stuff. So, this is Ryan SR2264. Wait, hang on. This is Ryan SR2264. Sign out, me amigos. Hope you guys have a great day.